Welcome back everyone to Life and Fork. On today's episode, I'm going to be showing you how to make a classic chimichurri sauce. Chimichurri is an Argentinian, kind of almost like a pesto. This sauce that I'm going to be showing you today is a simple version of it with just a couple simple ingredients. So stay tuned and watch the video. First, we're going to add a half a cup of vegetable oil. Next, we're going to add one cup of red wine vinegar. Now I'm going to take a lime, split it in half, and squeeze it in there. Fresh lime juice over non-fresh, preferably. Always use the fresher lime. The canned lime juice or the bottled lime juice isn't the same. You could also use a juice press to get it all out if it's easier for you. Uh, here I'm just using my hands and just trying to make sure I get every little bit of the juice out of it. Next I'm going to add a handful of garlic, which is about one ounce and a half, and a handful of shallots, two ounces. Shallots over onions are a little stronger. I'm going to add three ounces of parsley, and then I'm going to add three ounces of cilantro. As you can see, I added everything, including the stems. The stems are where you get the most nutrition from this sauce. I'm going to add two pinches of kosher salt, some ground black pepper, fresh, some smoked paprika, one tablespoon to be precise. You might be wondering why smoked paprika. It gives it a little bit of a more of a smokier taste than the Hungarian or the regular paprika. So if you can't find it, you can use the other kind of paprika, but for this recipe, I'm using smoked paprika. Now I'm gonna take my Vitamix and pulse it. By pulsing it, I'm gonna make sure that the sauce doesn't get really super watery. So I'm just gonna take a couple pulses at it just to get it moving around and getting all the ingredients mixed together. And then I'm gonna run it at a low speed to get the consistency that I want. What I want it to look like is more like a pesto. If you want, you can leave it a little bit more chunky like a, like a pico de gallo. But for me, I like it a little bit smoother. That way I can you know incorporate it easier on chicken or on poultry or even on seafood. I, I use the sauce sometimes with shrimp. It's very good has a little bit of an acid taste to it, which is from the vinegar and the lime juice, but it's very refreshing and it's very light. It brings out flavors in food that they're kind of mild, like chicken breast or shrimp. So there you have it. That is the chimichurri sauce. I hope you guys like this video. Stay tuned to next week for another video. Love you guys. Don't forget to hit subscribe. Bye.